Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I just want to show you how I keep my bikes looking like they've just come out of a showroom. Make sure you stick around to the end to see how I get my F4 looking even better than it did rolling out of the MV Augusta factory floor. The first step is to wet the bike and remove as much dust and dirt as possible. This is critical because dirt can scratch your paint when wiping over it. Next I like to hit it with snow foam. This helps release some of the stubborn dirt and grease build up. It just makes the job easier. Now it's time to get in there with the washing mitt. I like to use a two bucket method. If you haven't heard of this, it's simply one bucket with soap suds and another bucket of fresh water. After each round of wiping, dip the washing mitt into the clean bucket of water first and then rinse it before dipping it into the soap suds. This will just ensure you have a clean mitt when wiping over your expensive paintwork. Now I like to use a brush to work away any grease or dirt that has worked its way into grooves or small gaps. At the moment, I'm loving Meguiar's Hybrid Ceramic Spray Wax. In this demo, I'm showing you how to apply the foundation layer, which is the first layer you ever apply to your paint. After you've rinsed the soap from your bike, apply the spray sparingly to the wet panels and work it in like you would normal wax. The SiO2 formula reacts with water, so make sure your paint is wet. If you're confused, Meguiar's have a great instructional video on their website. Now although Meguiar's themselves recommend spraying it on and wiping it straight off with a microfiber cloth, I've experimented with this product and found that working it in with an applicator first gives a better result. It just seems to provide a more consistent layer across the paint. Subsequent uses of Meguiar's ceramic spray wax will involve spraying the formula onto wet paint again and then rinsing it straight off before drying with a microfiber cloth. Here is the end result guys, look how the paint has that deep glass reflection.
So it's the first time I've ever used this hybrid ceramic detailer. It's intended for in-between washes and is rumored to give a deep mirror finish and improves water beading. This is applied to the dry paint and takes only a few minutes to apply. I'll also apply some turtle wax plastic protector, which contains UV stabilizers to protect and rejuvenate your unpainted plastic parts, but I won't show this part in the video. Well, that's a wrap guys. I really couldn't be happier with the results. Just look at that amazing gloss finish. I really hope you enjoyed the video and learned something new. If you enjoyed the video, please give me a like and subscribe to my channel so I can keep making more videos like this. Thanks for watching and see you all next time.